Near South Head, one of the rocky sentinels of Sydney Harbour, is a little company of fishermen who like to combine their fishing with a spot of climbing. And the more dangerous the climb or the descent, the more they like it. They can swarm over precipices with hardly foothold enough for a fly, where one false step would mean stark tragedy. <laughs> With Rod and Creel on back, these young daredevils swing down to the sea, but there's still some more climbing to be done. Natural handholds give them a little extra help, and they can do with it. Don't look down or you'll get dizzy. One little error of judgment and it'll be the last. There's a drop of 300 feet. And that doesn't look any too safe, does it? But to these nerveless climbers, it doesn't look any too dangerous. The risk of breaking their necks simply adds spice to the adventure. So they follow the hazardous trail, often trusting their precious lives to the strength of a rope. And all this for a few fish. An ominous reminder of the perils that beset even the most experienced climber. The fishing grounds are not accessible by boat because of the dangerous swell that surges over the sunken rocks. And even here the young daredevils run a great risk. One high wave deflected from the rocks would be vicious enough to knock a man down and break his legs, or worse. And he risked his life to catch just this. 